Hey, it's Michelangelo Caruso. I want to talk to you about closing your presentation, essentially closing uh, the call to action. As you know, all presentations should have a call to action. It's what the French call the raison d'etre, I believe is the pronunciation, but the reason for existence. The reason a presentation exists is to uh, deliver a call to action uh, which can be psychological, it can just be buying in and getting some agreement, it can be about a monetary type of a transaction, it can just be um, uh, something that brings them closer to you in terms of a behavior or modification. They're, they're now going to start uh, a new procedure or they're going to start being safer if it's a safety presentation. But something should change at the end of your presentation if you do it right and, and, and it happens vis-a-vis -vis the call to action. So I have a few tips I want to share with you uh, as you deliver the call to action in your presentations. And the first is that you would, uh, after of course establishing that, they, that there's a problem, you know, that they need whatever it is that you're selling or whatever it is that you're providing. Uh, let's say that it's a safety presentation and there have been some terrible accidents lately, right? We need to be safer. Here's why we need to be safer. We know because we've had these accidents. And now here's the procedure for being safer. So you establish what's, what, what's gone wrong or what might not be sufficient. And when I do sales training, we're talking to uh, companies all the time about uh, the fact that their sales aren't at the level that the company thinks that they should be at. So I keep reminding them, we know that the sales are lower than you thought, let's bring them up, here's how to do it. And I take them into the call to action, whatever that call to action might be. So the key is when you go into this call to action, if you've staged it properly with trial closes along the way in the presentation, with this idea that something's broken and needs to be fixed, right, that you would want to use a positive adjective before the noun. In other words, if you're selling, say, a book, uh, which I do, I sell my books, right, I will tell people it's a fantastic book or it's easy to read or really fun, right? I'll tell them something about it that's positive and true, by the way, and true, so that they are more psychologically disposed to actually making the purchase. If I just say, now I've written a book on the subject and I hold the book up, it's not nearly as powerful as if I say, now I've written a really fun book on the project and I hold it up. You see the difference? Do you hear the difference? Many of us have trouble flying our own flag. I know for years I wouldn't tell people it was a great book because I thought it was bragging. Other people would tell me it was a great book and I would say, why, thank you very much. But when it came time for me to sell my own book, I wouldn't tell people it was great. And that's wrong. If it's a great book, a great product, a great service, you should tell people so. And don't be ashamed, especially if, uh, be, uh, do not be ashamed if it's your own product or service. So, the positive adjective before the noun. Uh, a second technique that you can do in the close that's very, very effective is this thing called the relative price. So, um, I might tell you, uh, if, uh, for example, if the item isn't on sale, I'll tell you it's such a good value because you would normally pay something like such and such, right, if you bought it in the store uh, sometime. So, I might say, uh, uh, I'd say uh, this book is... Uh, uh, only $19.95 today. Uh, and I hope you can get it today because if you bought it in the store, you'd pay $26, $27 for it. You see what I've done? I've created a sense of urgency and, and um, uh, importance about this current offer because otherwise you're going to pay several dollars more when you go to the store or buy it anywhere else, online or wherever. That's called a relative price. Now ideally, the price that you're quoting at the, at the end of your presentation for the close is less than the price that they would pay if they went someplace else. So the relative price um, uh, should be, uh, should, it should be an advantage for them to take action right now. That's the idea, to get them to take action right now. So we've got two techniques on the table for you. The first is this idea of a positive adjective before the noun, during the close, in the final moments of your presentation. The second technique that uh, you've learned in this video is this idea of a relative price. And the third technique is something I call VIP service. VIP service means you're going to give the listener, uh, the, audience, uh, the audience members in your presentation, uh, some sort of special treatment that they couldn't get anywhere else. I call it VIP treatment. 
And the VIP stands for very important person, right? We want people to feel special and you can make them feel special in your presentation. It's a great time for you to do it because you can tailor the message in, in real time for the group. And I do this all the time at my presentation. So uh, the call to action shapes in different ways depending on what I'm selling. But I'll tell you the technique and then I'll show you in a real time in a demo uh, right now, uh, a real life product launch actually, uh, in this video. So you'll, you'll be able to see it coming at you in two different directions. So the first is, if I was closing in this uh, final section of my presentation of this video, which I am, I would say something like, now uh, I want you all to go out and be ultra successful. It's really important to, you, to me that the people who take the time to listen to me and, and, and my audio programs and watch me on video and buy my information products are extremely successful. I, I stake my reputation on it and that's why I want the best for you. And I'll, and I'll build this kind of script into the program so that you know I really do care about you. You're not just an invoice number to me. That's a bit of this VIP treatment that I was referring to earlier. Uh, a second way that I can demonstrate for you in this video is to tell you about a live product launch that's happening right now for a new DVD that's coming out on the market. I don't even have a copy to show you because they're, they're, they're being duplicated and as, as I speak. But the program is called Present Like a Pro and it's a DVD which means it's a movie and you can watch it. And I actually demonstrate my best techniques for presenting and uh, the program is recorded live in front of a sold out audience at Walsh College in Troy, Michigan. And we had the best time with this program. I have people on stage with me and we're making them laugh and it really, really is a fun way to learn. Uh, this is especially good DVD as a training video for your sales team. You can uh, place segments of it in different uh, meetings that you're having with your sales team. You can, uh, of course, uh, let them uh, watch the DVD in its entirety on their own. You can uh, theme it out and, and pull out different themes, right, and show people based on what's happening at your company. So it's a fantastic way to learn and a very effective program. In fact, the program is so effective that if you're not completely satisfied with the content in the DVD, you can send it in, send it back to me, and I'll give you a complete money back refund, unconditional. I want you to be happy. You're, it's important to me that you're happy with everything that I do for you. So if you'd like to order this uh, DVD, you can go to the website, which is presentlikeaprodvd.com, presentlikeaprodvd.com, and we'll hook you up. Now, I've got a special price for you, VIP treatment, relative price, right? That uh, when you use the promotion code VIDEO, V-I-D-E-O, I'll know that you watched this video, so that's good for me because I understand the, the, how my promotional techniques are working. And you'll get 50% off the price of the DVD. That's five zero. That's a huge, huge discount. I'm not sure any other way you're going to get that kind of a discount. Relative price. 50% off the retail price when you punch the key code, uh, the uh, keyword video into the promotional code when you order online at presentlikeaprodvd.com. Well, I hope this has been useful to you. I've taught you some fantastic techniques for being a more effective closer, which should make your presentations even more effective. And maybe even put some money in your bank account because almost all of you are selling something at the end of your presentations. A great product, a fantastic service. And uh, in this video series, I hope that we've been giving you some great techniques to, uh, to take your company to another level. My name is MichaelAngeloCaruso.com. More tips on presenting, on branding, on becoming an industry expert at my website, MichaelAngeloCaruso.com. Thanks very much. And again, get that Present Like a Pro DVD. It'll make all the difference in the world to you. I appreciate you.